Then... What? 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 Send me this. What? Send me this. Is it Bioware? Bioware. Just like release. Did, like, did you say Bioware released the D&D thing? I'm not getting anything. You said you tagged me and like, I'm saying nothing. Releases D and D. Let's see here. What is this? Release. Fire Rise release. From Bio Writers release Dungeons and Dragons campaign set. Du -du 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 -du. Oh, it's a li no, it's a campaign set. Uh, James Olin, the lead designer of Baldur's Gate Dragon Age Origins, stars Knights of the Old. Sorry, but Baldur's like these those games. Oh, uh, for a 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 for Oh, oh, god damn it, Glenn. Yes, yes, down on, down on, later, later, oh, focus. <laughs> oh, yeah, guys, we just think we knew, uh, Javelin. Good night, guys. I went through all that effort to design. I don't have to jump anymore. <laughs> yeah, and I can actually see the N7 on my chest. <laughs> yeah, you can notice that shit in thing. I wish I can get rid of I was thinking of adding a bit more white though to my javelin because of the cape bit. Alright, that's what it is. Either way. There was actually a way for a fucking... Oh well, I can actually fly longer. Yeah. And there we go, I'm over here. <laughs> um, there was a way for ja uh, for storms to kill themselves off though during a fight, wasn't there? While flying. And hovering. I think it had something to do with oh, combos or something, or was it uh, using ice abilities?
Okay, we can target it. I hope. down. One unit beam from that fucker got me down. I'm expecting to be with the title of the game set. I'm expecting the dragon right Shit, you know? Oh my god, my attacks are only doing like 21 damage. Doing this with a brand like a new javelin build. Not good. No, I've been using them on their power. Yeah, I can't do that. Yeah. Why are you keep talking to me? I'm doing no damage to you. <laughs> like every <laughs> every time I I use it, like I'm literally doing no damage to this fucker, and I get hit every time with that. Oh shit, two of those fireballs. <laughs> I 
I really hate this. I, I, I miss my interceptor. I miss being able to do shit. Another wave like that already? on me. What happened to, you know, launching one at each player? You know how he spawns like those elemental ones? That's the only thing I can really do with any sort of efficiency. Is it'll take out all of them in one hit. Shit! Yeah, that's what got me. I got overheated and then I was forced to, you know, dive bomb then into the wave. And he's looking right at you. I can try and... Um, okay, never mind. You already went over to him. Shit, I thought was someone in those elementals. I'm saving my lightning for when Yoey summons them. Comes it, heal me, I'm right behind the wall. Alright. No. Alright, cause I was just thinking, cause like, uh, I've, I'm in like total cover right now. Okay. Shit. Over, over here, but no shield. Not, 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 I can't fly. We glide. Oh shit, fireballs! Oh, for fuck's sake. I hate those fireballs. With a burning passion. Like, they, like the accuracy is ridiculous. I'm down, guys. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, two of those fireballs uh, hit me uh, one right after the other. I guess some good shit for my storm. <laughs> so, where are we heading to now? Yes. That'll be a good opportunity to possibly level up my storm. Yeah, you, you could wait. Yeah. Uh, 
The Player's Guide for Odyssey and Dragon Lords is available to download for free on the Drive Through RPG website. Uh, the campaign setting is expected to release in May. Okay, I'm jumping straight onto that. What was it? Ah, oh, shit, what was the dev team called again? Okay, here we go. Scrolling up. First guide. Copy. Venture to Google. Paste. I'm expecting great things from this uh, document. Just because the guy was one of the writers for like some of the biggest RPGs for, that Bayer had. You know? Includes the overview of history, factions, kingdoms, laws, and the forgotten content. Learn about the gods of times. Class back backstories. Includes the guide guidance on character creation process. Includes potential names, suggested backstories, new player races. Oh, are we not getting classes? Ugh. <coughs> I would be expecting, um, what's it called? Some class. Ooh, Glacial Spear. Mm. Now, well, this is the Definitive Player's Guide. The next is just a campaign setting guide, which doesn't really give you many classes. They more often just give you, like, subclasses. So anyway, Glenn, since this is your story, um, would you like me to debuff enemies or what? Well, what would you like? Jesus, just keep killing me. Oh. I'm just curious, because some people might have preference. Well, Warren, you're already in a squad. By joining our squad, yeah. Kill him. Oh, then that's that. that, that then that's a uh, debuff then. <coughs> Interceptor. Uh, debuffer. Exit. Okay, let's see. I'm opening up his documents now. 28 pages. So, it's not much. <laughs> it's really good. It looks. What? The narrators. Did you say that? Flame backstories. Hmm. Um, there's some thing called Epic Paths. What's this? Epic Paths are optional, additional character creation. One occurring theme of ancient mythos. Heroes are born of the gods. Epic Paths are designed to give players a mythic archetype for their heroes. Um, each player should choose one of the epic paths described in this section. This will determine the, the hero's mythic context, when the land of Hillian and influence relationship and the gods. Funny thing is, on this thing they also have a picture of a uh, drag, like a wyvern mount. So, hmm. there's the doomed one. There's demigod. Uh, gifted, the haunted one, the lost one, the vanished one. And each one seems to get like, um, well, they even give you examples like the last one, Chronicles of Narnia, Wizard of Oz. So like, you know, like what type of like a hero story you should be expecting? Oh. The, the Demigod. For players who love Hercules and Kratos. 
<laughs> I like how they just specify Kratos. <laughs> uh, the doomed one. For player, people who like uh, Achilles and Melibon. No idea who that says. The gifted one. For those who like Jason and the Argonauts. Heroic tasks. One. To find a dragon edge, hatch it and raise a dragon to be your companion. Any dragon egg given to or found by you will only will one day be uh well sorry will be the only day away from hatching. When a dragon worldling is bonded to you, the oracle can bring the creature to her lair. Th their time flows differently and dragon will soon hatch. Divine Oh yeah yeah. yeah. Glenn be, there is someone that appears to give you a dragon, so Glenn, are you in your cutscene? Okay. Um Here's the special ability of the here's a divine blessing though for the gifted one. While mounted on a on a dragon, you gain dragon the that dragon's damage resistances, damage immunities and senses, blind sight, dark vision, and its passive perception if greater than yours. If the dragon is an adult or an ancient dragon, you can also use its legendary resistances, but this all this counts towards the total number of uses. So this one actually gives you a dragon. From uh basically from level one. <laughs> when a dragon woman is bound to you, the orc can bring the creature to her lair. Their time flows differently, and the dragon will soon reach. Isn't that cool? Why do people be find something fascinating back at the ruins? Shaper instruments. Never a dull moment. <sighs> the only thing I would say that's questionable by the gifted one is the fact that. <laughs> Giving the player like a full proper dragon can be very broken. You know what I mean? No trace of the Dominion so far. Maybe this will be. So the only way I can see them properly balancing that It'll get in the way of your investigation. Okay. The only way I can see them properly balancing this would be depending on the campaign setting guide. On how old dragons are in this world. I think that's all of them. Can you look that far behind me? Because I just did this mission today. Looks like we've cleared yeah. out the scorpions. That'll make it easier to continue the investigation. Those are not normal remains. Looks like some kind of goo. Blood. It doesn't look like blood to me. Decomposition? Too quick. Unlikely. Perhaps the metaphor. Side effect of division? Let's get some samples. Agreed. That's 
really gross. Bring the samples to Aruna Call. Yes, our discussions have led to a hypothesis that the split... In warped reality, there are side effects. Aruna Call specializes in that. She's on expedition helping the Sentinels. On it. Yeah, this thing definitely seems really good. It's just poorly organized at the moment, as from what I can see. Sentinels are under attack from Scars. They're going to need your help. Prison camp? The kidnapped arcanists. The scars have them in cages here. I wish they would do for the bench the there. Because like, this is a heavy cost that they made. It allows you to have multiple warriors. Right. Because, like, it gets really. <coughs> yeah. It's not only that, it's, it gets really awkward when, like, for example, like, I get my, for example, my interceptor about, around the debuffing of enemies and then, you know, comboing the, the like, left and massive damage. But if 
for example, if someone ends up using, uh, if I get, if I accidentally combo with someone's uh, lightning ability, then that messes up what I was aiming to do. You know. You rack up with those two combined. Yep. Yep. I really like this build. The only thing is, I can only really do massive AoE shit when I'm either using my ultimate or when I'm using Venom Spray. Which is why I want to build, you know, the lightning one. So that way, if I'm if I am just doing expedition to for like getting harvesting and all that, I can, you know, do that type of stuff. Just go through mobs. <clears throat> Beacon. I'm going to wait in the March Bay since we're doing Glan Stories. Oh no. Ooh, a new Fallout 4 mod's been released. Trades missions on demand from assassinations to base captures. Nice. You're already ready, Duck Glenn. Yeah, no, he's mm -hmm. always Oh, okay.
Oh wow, another Power Royale game. <clears throat> Spell Force, or whatever. It's basically a... It's a Power Royale game with uh, magic. I don't know... Yeah, but the only, but the only thing is though, it's still like technically aren't all barrials in some form or manner fast paced. Either way, it's still consistently the cheapest uh, game mode to make. There's one barrel that I will say is quite intriguing, and it, it's this Viking one, because it seems to revolve around um, melee combat instead. <clears throat> so, Avatar. Um, not wizards. Uh, Games Workshop keeps teasing new images of the apparent new uh, chaos models that are supposed to be coming out next month. Mm. Was that March or May? I can't remember. But basically, there. I think it's March. But chaos is supposed to be getting a huge um, overhaul. But, um, mm. From what I'm seeing, I, we're, it looks like we're mostly just getting. Uh, what's it called? <clears throat> uh, new models to deal with the new base. Because apparently, uh, like, there, because there was a change in the base as well in there. I'm tracking yeah, some position. Do you see it? New yes. model. Going after. But not in the sense of uh, you know, like new units. Well, we are supposed to be getting a few new units. I've heard that we're supposed to be. Like, I'm hearing from what I'm seeing on the images. It's Hurry. mostly new models. Maddie's lost the ability to perceive time and space normally. What? It's complicated. I'll go as fast as I can. Hmm. Um, it seems to be like Looks a like mixture of like. You should be able to catch up. Um. For the most part, uh, I'm hoping it's a lot of new units because that's what I'm. That's the biggest rumor I'm hearing about. Um, there's a few definite ones that I've seen in terms of pictures that they see that are definitely 100% new. Like that one that, uh, the one that I showed you, Dale, that you made fun of. But a lot of people are also saying it's uh, that's just a new model for the obliterators. Scars. Like it's not new, new. It's just 
Hey, it looks like marble. We are supposed to get one new engine there. Uh, the Damon engine. Which still works. But the big thing that I want to look forward to is a new Abaddon model. Because, yeah. Apparently he's been getting... He himself has been getting lost on a new model for so long. But we're, uh, we're also expect like a lot of people are also saying that this is going to be where we get our, like the chaos, our counter, and the, um, what's it called, the Primaris. So we're going to see Chaos's answer to, so we're going to see, uh, potentially, again this is only a rumor, we're going to see what Chaos has to counteract the Primaris issue. A lot of people are saying, Chaos players are in two camps, it seems. Some want uh, a fabulous file to create his own primary. But then there's people who don't want that because they want something more unique to Chaos. Instead of, oh, we have primary. You know what I mean? Those scars were quick to attack. Do you think they ambushed Sumner? Wouldn't rule it out. He must be in the area, but he might be hurt or worse. We need to find him, quickly. <laughs> Summer's not in the crashed suit. He must have taken it off for some reason. Shit, Hello? I don't mean to do that. Freelancer, is that you? Summer? Matthias? Yes, it's me. Bloody scars, I knew I couldn't take them and there was a crack in the rock. And you couldn't fit into it while wearing a javelin. Wait. I think this passage leads me to the room I was looking for. I'll keep going. Stay where you are. I can handle myself, and I'm already here. There'll be another entrance. Meet me inside. I'm sending you a location. All the maps mark it as a subterranean passageway. It could lead to the cave network that Sumner's trapped in. It seems the YouTuber Yang Yi uh, Anthem Campaign Review Broken Promises Missing Soul mm. Like uh, I'm nowhere like I'm not that much further than Glenn but there are some stuff that I wish that was a bit more you know Bioware's signature for example like I want more I want more dialogue No, because of the Bioware game. You know what I mean? Freelancer. You there? On my way. I found what I'm looking for. Like, story yeah, good, but this it's place is just exactly what I need. something that made, you know, what made Bioware, Bioware. Dale, that's, um, actually, Dale, what do you think of the story? I do want to say about this game. Oh my god, what's the time? What's new? What are you doing? Be careful! Is that epic? I got my first master word. Different energies. He was right. But we knew we needed a javelin to get out of here, and neither of them had the guts to borrow one. You mean, steal? Sure. Whatever. But yeah. Got the data we need. Ah, it took someone with real drive to. Oh, crud. Sumner, what's happening? Oh, 
I'm level 25. But yeah. What? Yeah, I see it. Got it. Yeah. Yeah. I am really glad now that I got the call. Leave it to me, fix that relic. Over the storm. My storm is just not ready yet to be on the Titan. You know these are last ones. Yeah, so you guys definitely seem like they take the fast test for longer. Guys, yeah. Oh, shit, guys, the other guys are coming over now. Down, I think. Yeah. Uh, Glenn, let me know when your thing's ready. Your ultimate's ready. And then I can mark. Alright. When, you, when you're ready to use it, let me know. And then I'll find mark. So you can take more damage. Alright. I'll just use acid for now. So you can see before I'm able. Yeah, I'll just use acid for now. Overshot his thing. Alright, I have my own. I, I don't have my ultimate ready, but I have the Debo thing. Ben, you ready? Because I want to pop my target beacon when someone has their ultimate. Popped it. Down. I'm down. There's the fireball. I'm the venom. And I'm gonna pop the target beacon again. <laughs> Never mind. No time to waste. We need to get back to the others. Realizer. Yeah, I can't wait to see uh, what actual 100% new units Chaos Space Marines get. <clears throat> and then I can't wait to see what the I like how they tease though the new Abaddon model by te by faking out the video where now to show off the new Primaris lieutenant lieutenant and it's a Primaris underneath the foot of uh, what's it called Abaddon <laughs> like we know it's we know it's Abaddon it's just that we don't get to see the model fully <clears throat> it, it was a teaser for Abaddon. <laughs> And they got people to look at it by teasing. Oh, masterwork, Athenia's Gambit. <coughs> masterwork, light machine gun. Upgraded, relentless. Most balanced gun in its class. When reloading, detonates a combo explosion <coughs> in the immediate area. Uh, plus three percent fire damage. Plus twenty-five percent weapon mag. So 
size, plus 10% uh, ammo pickup, and 18% uh, shotgun damage bonus. It's not the best, but I can definitely see use for some of my other weapons. I'm just ha I am just happy that I got it. That is definitely going on my... Um, <coughs> I'm, I may pop that towards... What's it called? Um, my storm. Because I... Mm, it's really good if you're playing with other... It's it's really good if you're playing um with others. Someone sounds like they're burying into their mic. The only reason why I wouldn't use a light machine gun with the classes because I really want to make use of, you know, having, weapons. yeah, the unique weapons. Yeah. So it's definitely so that is definitely going onto my storm. I'm gonna apply it to ice right now. Because I actually, the funny thing is, I actually was using Rel a relentless for uh, my ice build for Storm. Now the only handy thing is, I ha now have benefits for using it with combos. So I'm going to dismantle relentless. If I can find it again, where the hell is it? There it is. <laughs> I imagine it would be more useful for my interceptor, but oh uh, well, what are you going to do? <clears throat> the... I also got barrage. I also got a uh, barrage in terms of a heavy as a heavy pistol there. Crushing fire rate allows for the most bullets in the least amount of time. Its RPM is 500. I might actually equip it to my interceptor as well. Definitely equipping it to mob killer. Because it's a light machine gun. <laughs> Just line them all up. You know? stuff out later. <coughs> also switch out to 
people here. Because he's also in melee. So he might as well might as well equip the, the warden. Gambit. A new venom bomb, which is weaker. Shit. And strike system. Oh yes, finally I got an epic venom spray instead of the one that I've been using. The only thing that's blue still is my target beacon, which is now set to thing now. Now here's where it gets fun. Time to make a statement. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I would recommend you do the other quest for uh for because you will get locked out of that quest. Yeah, I built it as as soon as I could without doing you know the two quests for it. And it seems like I'm about to get locked out of one of them. Um, a quest log is at a quest for my log is that the vanishing on me. If she actually um, after I forged the shield. <coughs> so. Yep. Deniability. Exactly. I've marked a potential ambush site. Coming up on the Strider. Where's Dax? Patching her through. Dax, are you in position? Yeah, about that. Seriously? I got stuck. Talon's a popular guy.
Oh god, this is a legit thing. I've only reloaded the one. This thing, this thing thank you. Yes. Which oh my down? god, picking up I, I, I ammo we filled the map. These guys are all squirrely. <sighs> this is all my fault. What do you mean? Nothing. Check this rider. Maybe it'll have another lead. I don't really care that they didn't like I don't That was amazing. Oh. They're not random. It's a map. What? How? My patrol's nearby. I'll explain in person. In person? Really? Just bring <laughs> it to me. Wait. <sighs> yeah, we got that thing. Oh yeah, yeah. He used it like he used it like right Green up in the face. Over here. Let me see the map. Yeah, he uses it in uh, like basically in punching range. Instead of punching, he just moves his arm downwards. Still looks like the enemy. Putting him in half. How do you know this? Yeah, again, it's the reason why I went, like, that and the lower, because it's only how I'm going to use a grenade launcher, and whatnot, is oh, the main reason why when I did. Hey, check the routes. Is there one nearby? There is, actually. <clears throat> Sending it now. What? What the hell? Like, I, I wonder if like, we found the Strider, but like... it's been ambushed by a Titan. Today's not a good day for Striders. <laughs> hey, the Titan took care of the hard part. Right. Now, you just gotta find a way inside without it killing you. That's always the rub. Oh yeah, beacon. Mordaka. I don't even have enough time to read one of the damage numbers like coming up. There's too many damage indicators. Those rings. Really hate those rings. I'm down. Where are you guys? <laughs> Glenn, down. <laughs> hey, Glenn, you took uh, that beam for a few seconds. Ooh, there's new items being used, uh, and being recommended to me. Hey, 
Pinterest is actually really good for collecting a whole bunch of the uh, Cargo door won't budge. Battery's fried. Check the wreckage for a replacement. Maybe take out the Titan first. Just a thought. After I beat them up. Need to run away. Yeah, when it comes to the time, when he suddenly targets you after you did so much damage to him. Pardon me in my mind, I'm just picturing like that scene from, um, um, from Age of Ultron. Yeah, well, I have a good um, feeling. You know, like, Tony just goes, I'm so oh, sorry. You know, like when Tony uh, broke um, a two of the Hulk, and he goes, I'm sorry. Like, after doing a whole bunch of damage to a Titan, you know, they get that Unibeam and just focus it on you. Pardon me, I'm just like, I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't kill me. It's like even the fucking Colossus with his shield gets taken out. Like, okay, can I use we that for armor or something? Uh, it's still not working. Power flow needs a full reset. Titan really did a number on her when it attacked. Because there's like I ha there's there's components that really increase your armor. The uh, class is like, um, that did it. Door should open now. Like, I've found the bones into that. Idea. Get the overlay. Old damage reduction. We found another scroll. Listen the images together. Well, what do you know? Dax was right. If it happens again, she'll catch up with a broken clock. Hey, I can hear you. Marking Talon's base. Got it. On my way. Let's see who gets there first. What about your patrol? Eh, they'll be fine. Take out the camp's defenses to reach him. Focus on the turrets. Okay. I like her just because she's never typically like a bad guy. Well, okay, she's one of the two. Dex, you okay? This thing was built to take a few hits. Boom! You see that? I'm so badass. Watch your six! You mean like, Earth going to kill you. Uh, They are either damsels in distress or they're the rebellious uh princess of You know what I mean? Yeah. Is it over? Already? Stay back! I'm and what did you, say, you Don't tell me that's talent. <laughs> no, just a worm. Really? You won't be a problem. How do you? Come on, let's finish this. Mm. I see. I still only see those uh, type of characters in anime as well. Literally, the last one's Batman, 
contact. He's like, no, nah, fuck it, I'm gonna try to kill her. Hey! Hey, that's far enough! No one has to get hurt. Whoa, 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 whoa! All we want is that journal. I know! Talon gave you one job. Make sure you don't get it! Did Talon give you permission to burn it? No. Maybe! Shut up! Okay, why does Talon even want that journal? Because it's a treasure map. All those missing people carried valuables into the jungle. And when I find them, I'll be rich. You shouldn't have chased me, Dex. You shouldn't have robbed me, Talon. It's what I do. You knew that when you hired me. You hired these people? That's how they got your journal? It's hard to do background checks out here. Besides, Talon used to be a sentinel. And now he's been reduced to this. Huh. And you die first. <laughs> Yeah, is that your hand? No, it's mine. Move it. Now. Okay. Which way did Talon go? Commander, how'd you find us? We followed the smoke. Passed by what was left of your javelin. I can explain. No! You're done. There's someone waiting at Fort Tarsus to take you home. Commander, wait. This journal belonged to my aunt. It can solve the mystery of the Emerald Abyss. Hey! Give it back! Consider yourself lucky that you still have a javelin, freelancer. At least Talon doesn't have the journal. He doesn't need it anymore. Just didn't want you to have it. <laughs> He's so far ahead. You should just give up. Give up? Yeah. Not what I do. Good. Dax! We'll figure it out. Just meet me back at the port. Sentinel sponsored artworks have been nice. I like how Fort Tarsus gets nicer looking as you level up people's loyalties. Dax has been escorted to her apartment. Should I patch her through? Go ahead, Faye. Freelancer, I've got an escape plan, but we still need my aunt's journal. 
Dax, you really need to work on your whispering skills. What? I'm like a grabbing in the night. Uh-huh. Does Vool still have the journal? As far as I know. Tried to get it back, but he says I can't be trusted with that book of nonsense. You might have more luck, though. It's worth a shot. Oh good. <clears throat> at least that, at least that, uh, that also counted for me progressing the story. <coughs> so hold on. Oh goody! Two people want to talk to my character. Three people. It lowers the cost it's of ten. Times ten. Ooh. Okay, I did not know it was going to be... <sighs> Fuck. So that's it? It'll be three of you forever? Not all the Manifold's mysteries have been unlocked. We may yet find a way to reverse the split. It's not a priority. The Heart of Rage and the Dominion are. After that, well, that's if we still want to merge. If? I can't quite imagine what that'd be like now, not being me. Not having these silly lumps around. Oh my stars, me too. I agree as well. It's wonderful to see all of you getting along. I never didn't want to get along. That was someone else's problem. Fair, completely my fault, sorry. An apology? My goodness, you've experienced growth. We should be capable of change now. Even if we weren't before. Oh, you know what this is? This is like Garaxis on Crimson Lancer. Oh, no, not you too. The Garaxis storyline was terrible. Garaxis was a javelin suit that gained self-awareness after an accident with a relic. Several episodes were dedicated to Garaxis developing their own identity. Inanimate object learns to be a person. Oh, my favorite. I should dig up those archives. Ugh. Ignore him. He thinks everything is stupid. It was. Especially when they made Graxus fall in love with their own pilot. So much for getting along. I thought the romance was sweet. Hold the forges. Did Errol just express an opinion? I am not carrying any forges. Nope. Not quite there yet. Anyway, we should let the freelancer go. <laughs> you sure? I don't want you to kill each other in my absence. I think... I think we'll be fine. Maybe even great. Take care, Freelancer. We'll see you around. Also, 79 minutes. I should really reset.